You are watching an AC Media production. Coming up this week on The Choice. Welcome to this week's The Choice, and this week we're heading down to Florida. Osceola Outfitters, That's Uncle right. Hop. That's right, we're going gator hunting, but actually it's just us Ultimate girls. that predators. Get, just the girls get to go gator hunting this time. Because we shot all the big gators, so that's what we're going to show. Yeah, this, we're hunting with a bunch of swamp lizards. Hey, not with, we're hunting for. Oh, I'm sorry. Thanks. It slipped out. This week's lucky logo is Cabela's. Cabela's, my, our, our favorite place to shop. Yes. Yeah, so watch for the Cabela's logo and then the show we'll tell you what to do with that. They're going to load you down with like all kinds of Cabela's Yeah. Gear. So we should just get going though because I have a really cool hunt to show. Well, yeah, I mean. I got Megan's TC. And we're, we're predator calling them in. And we're standing in deep water. Swamps, baby. Absolutely. Check this one out. Swamp lizards. Well, we're going back into this, it's a creek in here big, that we're in the swamp, but okay. we're in the creek. I just noticed the water has come up pretty high from all the rain, so... We're going to get wet. You don't have to worry about going over your boots because you're going to be wet, but I'm going to try to stay dry. So, everyone else that has knee-high rubber boots, we they're going to get really wet. stay dry, but we may go over our boots, I don't know. Well, my boots have been getting wet all week long. I only have hikers on anyway, so... Okay. All right, let's go. Let's go. At first, you're kind of nervous. You're walking through and you're thinking, oh man, there could be snakes, there could be gators, there's spiders, who knows what's in the swamp. And we're going and going and we get set up in the spot and we saw a, a nice gator coming. Okay. There's another one out there going across. Then we had a smaller gator going, we had the calls running. And the smaller gator comes up, and I'm not saying small, small, I mean it's a six, six and a half foot gator. Well, it comes into the call, and it gets to the point where it's like 10 feet from us. So I cock the TC back, and he goes, go ahead, take it. I put that Nikon scope right on his eye, and that was it. Bang, he gave me the wave, and down he went. Ralph, did he say yeah? Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. I can see him. It was like 10. <laughs> that was self-defense. 10 yards. That was in self-defense. That's what that was. So we're sitting there, we're all excited, and we're high-fiving each other like, woo, yeah, that was great. And uh, Poppy goes, oh, 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 there's a big gator coming. Okay, look, I gotta get, get your gun loaded. Poppy. Yep, there's a big one. There's a big one. in the current though. Okay, I got him in my sights. You want him? Yep. If he's moving, just lead him just a touch. There you go. Yeah! Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's oh. I didn't see a foot. Oh, 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 yeah. It's a big gator. It's a whopper. <laughs> watching some yeah, yeah. stuff going on here. I'm gonna go back, get a boat, okay. and get the hooks, and see if we can get out here and recover this okay. thing. Well, Hoppy had to go get a boat, this little dinghy, because where I shot him was out in the middle, and the first one I shot, it's only about 10 feet away from us. It gets deep, but we can get it, but we probably saw six or eight gators in this water hole, and I'm thinking, I'm not going out there in the water to get that gator. So Hoppy went and got the boat, and he came over, he made himself these little paddles out of palmetto branches, leaves, and it was kind of cute. And so we hopped in the boat, we went over, and we ended up getting my gator out of there. Hoppy and I ended up getting it in the boat, and we came back, back over towards where everyone else was at and showed him the gator. I mean, oh my gosh, what a blast. We got him. <laughs> what do you think of that? Woohoo! How about that one? 
We went out there and I shot a nice gator, six six footer, six and a half footer. Yep. Went down right there, and then all of a sudden we're like, "There's more gators! There's more gators!" And then uh, this it, guy come floating by. It got by. so crazy there, playing it back in my mind. I can't remember exactly what all happened because there were. Oh my gosh, there's gators! It was crazy. It was crazy, and then all of a sudden I look back and I go, "Hoppy, there's a big one out there!" And we saw him coming, and he floated in I and knew. floated out. And when you spotted him from the distance, like he was coming, and we had all that brush there, yeah, I knew. Let's get set up, get really, really still. Lonnie was running the, the call. Yep. We had him go back the other side of us and, and lured him right That by. was right amazing. Was so, cool. and then he flipped and flopped and flipped and flopped and down he went and you went and got the boat and, the hook and we here got he sits. Wow, that, that's awesome. Hey, congratulations. You know, Thank you. what people don't realize is, I mean, we're predator calling them and happy. They've got so many gators. You've got to take advantage of going it down was. there. It's, and that first gator that came like in right was like, there. like 10 I'm feet like, from us. I'm like, you're going to shoot or what? I'm sitting Hoppy there. said, wait for a bigger one. And then all of a sudden this one comes in at 10 feet and I look up and I'm like, can I shoot him? He's what? like, yeah, you better shoot him. Yeah, you better shoot him. Thanks, Thanks, Hop. Thanks Hop. And then that big guy came through. And, oh, like oh my Jaws. Gosh. Dun, 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 dun. But now you don't want to go anywhere because we're still in the swamps yep. with Dusty and this time we're in even deeper water because it had rained more. Well it was up to our waist. I think it was almost over her head. It wasn't over her head. And what do you mean our waist? Welcome back to The Choice. Now I've got to give you a lot of credit because a lot of guys I know would not be wading up, you know, chest high into those swamps You're and not snakes kidding. and, and now, gators. And, and now the next day we go back with Dusty and here she is, it rained overnight, the water's even deeper and wait till you see this footage, it's amazing. And I mean, we had a lot of fun. It was, it was really cool. It was. We are actually gonna go Dusty back in the middle of this swamp, further back than what we were yesterday. Okay. With Vicki and there's a couple little small lakes in here and they're uh, maybe 100 yards long. More like ponds than lakes. I haven't been to this one in several years. <laughs> so we got plenty of help. So I figure if we get a nice gator, we can get some help to get them out of here. Perfect. This is um, gonna be fun this morning. The big, the big issue for me is finding the lake because it is a little bit hard to find in a swamp. It's a 6,000 acre swamp and it's just a little, little pond in the middle of this thing. So we're gonna take a long hike. That's right. I'm ready. And we're going to get wet before we get there, and we're going to get wet while we're there, and hopefully when we come out of there, we're, we're going to get dragging a gator. wet dragging a gator out. <laughs> So after a couple hours of tromping through the swamp waiting for Hoppy to find the appropriate place that we were supposed to be at, <laughs> we, uh, we finally got there and right away there was a beautiful eight foot plus alligator. Staring right at us. Mm -hmm. right down. What we done was snuck in here. We found the lake I've been looking for. There's a nice gator here. The problem is, is we've got a big grass tussock, a floating island between us and him. What we're gonna do is back out, go all the way around. It's gonna take us about 20, 30 minutes. There's no vegetation on the other side there, and there is a shoreline. He knows we're here, but I'm hoping if we get around there, maybe he'll be down at the bottom end of this lake. We got, we got to a point where he goes, I think this is where we want to be. And they turn the call on, and all of a sudden, this big gator just starts coming. Here he comes. He's coming. Wait till he gets in close. Here he comes. Don't move. Lonnie, be real still, he's right there. You want him? Right in his eye. Oh, hold it. I don't have a shot. Vicky. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa, 
baby. Yeah. Woo. <laughs> and it turned and come straight at us. She was able to take that shot and boom, right down it went. One shot this time. <laughs> Pink TC, all of us girls down here at Hoppies have been shooting gators and this is our good luck charm this week. <laughs> well, what do you think? I think I'm super excited. <laughs> I don't even know what to say. I'm so excited. We have been tr tromping through the swamp waist high all morning long looking for a gator and you said once we got to this pond. If I could ever find it I knew we were going to get one. I've, I've been in here it's been a while back but normally the water is not this high out through the swamp and it's it's contained into that area. There would probably been more alligators here had we not had all this water but once the water rises they want to get away get from away each from other and they just spread out and it's easier for them to feed in here. They get in here and catch hogs and deer and everything else. So, oh, uh, I'm so excited. Thank you again, Happy, so you're much. Welcome. It was an experience of yep. a lifetime. You are welcome. Well, it, it was an opportunity and an experience that I will never, ever forget. Memories like this are priceless. Congratulations, Dusty. Wow, Dusty. That was you, so you much girls fun. Our troopers, I have to admit it. Oh All my of gosh. you out there in the swamp. When we went back and we told everyone we were in water, you know, up to our waist. They didn't waist, believe us. Till they, they saw the they footage. They thought we were crazy and they saw the footage. They're like, you guys are even crazier than we thought you were. Yeah. And now, don't go anywhere because we come back. It's Megan's turn. We finally let Megan have her gun back. Yes. It's about time. I know. Thank There's you, Megan, for letting us use that gun. Don't go anywhere. Welcome back to the choice. Well, now we got it. You know, you girls are still troopers, and now with Megan, it's a little different setup. Yeah, we're on Highland now. We're now finally we're, we're dry. Not in the swamp anymore. Yep, but we're still predator calling, that's and they're right. still coming in, and that's yeah. what's so cool. And she's been trying. She, she has been trying. She's Hoppy's been trying pulled her off because it's smaller gators or whatever. She, I, she's ready. She is ready out. to squeeze that TC's trigger. Absolutely. When I knew last year I was coming to gator hunt, I was so stinking excited. I was like, wow, a gator. I can't believe I'm going to hunt a gator. Well, I, I came down here and I missed and I was really disappointed in myself because I wasn't confident with the gun and, you know, I just, I just didn't, didn't do as well as, as what I normally would have. So this year I was like, I'm going to bring my own gun. I sighted it in 25 yards. I was real confident with it. And you know, it's a pink and black TC and you know, it's just, it's a great gun. So um, when I came down, I was really, really confident where I wasn't last year. Megan's up to try to get her an alligator. We're in a, about a 20 acre, they call them bar pits, but it's a, it's a man-made hole here. We got some open water right up here. We got a big bird rookery. There's thousands of birds up here. Hopefully we're gonna get a gator to come out from underneath those birds because they're laying under there catching those birds as they fall out of their nests. Oh, wow. So we're gonna go down here and see if we can get Megan a shot at an alligator. Let's go. Yes. Well, Megan, I know you want me to give you the green light on that. Yeah, I was going to whack it. I had it right in my sights. Well, this winter, there was three really big gators in this pond right here. I'm guessing three of them between 9 and 11 foot. Oh, wow. They were at the other end of this pond, so we're going to go down there and see if we can nice. okay. call one of them in. All right. We, we came up to this one gator and I was I was on it. I mean, I was I was on that gator and Hoppy's like, nope, we're not going to shoot this one. It's you know we're going to find find a, a little bit bigger one. And but I was like, oh, are you kidding? I was so on that gator. But he put me on a, a bigger one.
Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes, baby. Where did he come from? I don't know, but he's right there. He's floating, he's doing the wave. <laughs> yes, he, thank you, Jesus. He had to come right out underneath where Ralph was calling. No. He, he, did the he wave. evidently come he's still out waving. right by Ralph because Ralph's calling right there and he he was right he there. He came out of the there. bushes where you were calling and popped up. When we recovered my gator, Hobby's like, hey, what are you going to make with this gator? I'm like, hmm, how about a makeup bag? He's like, are you kidding? I'm like, no, a makeup, a gator makeup bag. How cool would that be? You know, and then Vicky got a huge one. Dusty got one. We could have makeup bags. We could have purses and even luggage. I mean, can't beat that. Man, that was an awesome time. <laughs> I got him. I whacked him. I, I'm so excited. You got a, made a great shot. Thank you. It just trip. happened. You know, we're expecting that thing to come yeah. up, up through the lake And we're looking there. the wrong way. We totally had to reset up because he was just right there, right by Ralph. Some hunters we are. Our cameraman spotted it. <laughs> well, we were so focused on down there. I know. And it just pops up right here. Yeah, we're ten like, foot, oh. Ten foot from the call. You never know where these things yeah, are you at. You don't. You don't. Yeah. Take the skin and do something with the skin, I'm sure. Absolutely we are. I might need a makeup bag or a belt. A makeup bag. Yeah, a makeup bag. Maybe for my nail polish. What do you think? Pretty, A, isn't a makeup it? bag. Has anybody ever wanted a makeup bag? You know, you hear boots, shoes, maybe a purse, <laughs> but a makeup bag? I'm a little high maintenance. You know that. Oh, my gosh. You are too funny. I know. Pink and black gun, makeup bag out of gator. <laughs> makeup bag. <laughs> what can I say? You girls are like rocking and rolling with the TCs. Vegan. You Holy. Go, girl. That's that's let's see. 1 2 3 4 good four, gators. Four gators down and don't go anywhere cuz we come back and he rushes up next. Welcome back. We're still hunting swamp lizards. Yes, we're hunting swamp lizards and it's Amy's turn like we said. Yep. She's up. She is. Another girl, another gator. Wow. Let's see what happens. Another girl. Huh? Uh, well, we're down here in Florida. Um, Hoppy Kemper's taking me out alligator hunting, and uh, I'm ready to shoot me a big one. My heart's pumped. The first one goes up and then it goes down. It's like... Yeah. <sighs> my heart's about to jump out of my chest here. Yes. <laughs> yes. One, two, three. Oh. Man. Wow. Woo. <laughs> Woo. Oh, he's got a head for a, an 11 footer, but he's only going to be about nine foot because he's missing at least a foot of tail. <laughs> Look at that. It's been chewed off. Jeez. Boy, Hoppy spoils me rotten. All right, I'm, all kidding Amy, aside. Congratulations, Amy. Un unbelievable. But all kidding aside, you girls, I was proud of you. Thank you. All of you, because I mean, crawling through those swamps, going all through that stuff. There are a whole bunch of guys. They'd say they would in front of the guys, but I can tell you, they wouldn't. We had a blast down there. Thank you, Hoppy, and everyone down there at Oslo Outfitters. That was uh. really. Fun. It's our second family down there. It was. And speaking of adventures, because that's yes, what it was. Absolutely. If you happen to see the Lucky Logo, which was Cabela's, log on to choicetv.com, click on the Lucky Logo button, fill out some information, and someone's <laughs> going to win some great stuff from Cabela's. My favorite place to shop. Really? Yes, ma'am. Would have never known. Next week, 
Ralph and Zendel are heading to Texas. Yep, with, with John Denwaller with your and, 10 points. And, and Brian mm -hmm. taking our 10 points and we're hunting Texas in the snow. Yeah, that doesn't make any sense. No. Well, anyways, we want to thank you for making your choice. The choice. We'll see you next week.